create a selection in Affinity Photo. You can use the rectangle marquee tool, etc. So with this selection, you want to save it because you want to use it later. Well, what you do, go to select and save selection as spare channel. You can see the channels panel here. That's in view menu and down to studio and channels. Now, if I move that, so let's just move that over there. I can do exactly the same. So select, save selection as spare channel. And I can move it somewhere else, say up there. And again, select, save selection as spare channel. So you can save it a couple of times. You can see now you've got them over there. You can delete them as well. So you can just go through and delete those. Now you can click on it, which is fine. Actually, I just deselect it so you can see that. But that's not what I want. You can always restore it back to, as before. Just go here. What you need to do, just go over here. Say you want the first one that you created back again. Right click over the spare channel. Right click and you can rename it, delete, duplicate. But you can also go load to pixel selection. You can also add to, if you've got a selection there already, you can add, you can subtract as well from it. Load to background and so on. So there's a lot of great functionality there. But load to pixel selection. And then you've got your selection back again. So you decide, you know what, I don't want that one. I want that one, the second one. I can say now, go there. I can load to pixel selection. And then you can see it goes to the second one I created. But as said, you can go up here, go to this third one, and you can also add to pixel selection. So obviously I've got a selection already. And you can see now that one is quickly added to that. So it's a great way of storing. Simply just go to select, and save selection and you can save this one if you want as a spare channel and just add i don't know if there's a limit there might be there's always always a limit somewhere along the line but i've only done about five or six hope you found this of interest thank you much